Hey guys, hey everyone out there, how are y'all doing? You know it's a girl Twin D. Thank you so so much for stopping by the channel. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome, welcome to the camp, my longtime subscribers. Big up on yourself, nuff, nuff, and thank you all for the support. All right, let's jump straight into your message, guys. This is messages from your masculine. I hope you saw my message that premiered before. If you haven't, go back and watch it. All right. <laughs> Anyways, let's jump into your message and let's see what's going on. What messages your masculines have for you today? Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. All right, let's see what's going on. What messages they want to tell us. Let's see what they have to say. What's going on after the new year? 111 again. Yep. I know. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Where are they? I'm not. Okay, with a lot. All right. Okay, my gosh. Or at least give me some time to, to, you know, do a little shuffle. Let's see what's going on with masculine. Masculine. <laughs> All right. Wait, no man. Cho. All right. Gosh, gosh. I, I guess I'm just not listening. <laughs> I want to make love to you like you've never experienced before. I want intimacy in every way possible with you. I just want us to know each other like no one else before us has ever known. So this is what you've been um, tearing out my cards out of my hand for to tell your person that you want to make. Why don't you call them and tell them that yourself? Huh? My good God. Anyways, let's see what's going on here. I hope you're ready to make some major life changes quickly because I'm going to sweep you away. Think about simplifying your life as best you can. Because I anticipate this moving fast. So some of your divine masculines here, trust me, they, like they said, they ante anticipate this moving very, very fast. Because, yeah, that's why I want to tell you how much I want to be with you, how much I want to be around you, how much I want to make love to you, because I miss you. I miss you. Like, call, pick up the phone, tell them yourself, go see them. You know, having Twin D deliver these sexy messages is not fun, you know. It's not fun. But they have a plan. And they're planning on changing your life. Because you change theirs. You haven't heard from me because I'm on vacation or I'm taking a break away from everyone and everything to feel refreshed and renewed for a new and strong start with you. So, like I said, they had a plan. I know it's like they're going to put that plan into action. They're going to put that plan into action. So why haven't I been talking? Why haven't you been hearing from me? It's because I've finally woken up. I know I understand who you are to me, who I am to you, and where I belong. So let me go take a little break. So I can be refreshed. So that when I come towards you. I don't come looking all stressed out and unhappy. I want to be dolled up. <laughs> or whatever a man would do. You know. Or if your masculine is a woman. Let's see. What else do you want to say to your divine feminines? Yeah. Oh shoot. Okay, so you got some totally different energy right now. I'm with a toxic partner right now, but you're on my mind a lot. I will reach out to you once I've set myself free completely of this burden and can give you the good news. I've chosen to date someone else right now, so please respect that and give me time and space to see what I truly want. If we're truly destined, I'll see that clearly. As I explore this. So you see 456. You see what I'm always trying to tell you. 
even if your divine masculine goes off and be with somebody else after they break up whether with you or should I say after they separate with you because they never break it up with you after they separate from you or they separate from a karmic that they were with the reason they go be with somebody else is because again they have to learn some lessons so it seems whoever this person moves towards to here is very toxic. And it's because they're supposed to learn a lesson. Because what, what's happening here with your masculine is like they're running from you, true love, right? And they may have had a toxic partner. They chose to stay there. Things may have ended. They don't come to you because they're now free of the toxic partner. They try to fill that void that they have on the inside by finding somebody else because they're scared of your love because what you're giving them is love and not toxicity like they're used to. So they're scared, they run. And then they meet up on somebody else and they start dating that person and they're realizing that the same situation that they were going through with their toxic partner before is the same situation they're encountering right now. Which means there's a lesson from here to learn. And they're going to learn that lesson. And that's why they do that. Because they have lessons to learn. And they cannot come to you without learning those lessons. Because if they do, they're going to take that toxic behavior that they learned on you. They're going to take it out on you. And if that's what you want, oh, by all means, go ahead. Your life. But I don't want that shit in my life. Because I'm working very hard on mine. To feel loved by myself. Don't, I, don't have to have anybody to say I love you to feel good. Being able to just sit down and talk to God when I want to. Feeling free. I don't want nobody to come bring no cloud into my life. Nope. Let them heal. Let them heal guys. What else do you have to say? I don't care what others think of us. We are perfect for each other. That's all that matters. So you see, we have two different energies here, guys. Two different energies. What is going on, please? What does he want to say? I'm making plans for us behind the scenes. I don't want you to know about yet. I'm setting us up for a bright, stable future and want to impress you next we talk. Like I said, they have plans. And they're working on those plans. Working on bringing them into fruition. I wish you knew just how special you are to me. It kills me not to be able to tell you. You amaze me with your compassion and kindness through this time apart. I promise I'll make this up to you. So you see what this divine masculine here has done. They've come to this conclusion about how special you are to them. About the love that you were showing to them. That you really meant it. That's how you truly felt. And they're amazed by the way you treated them. And that's what they're going to have to learn over here. Whoever these ones are. That's what those ones will have to learn as well. What else do you want to say? I just want you to know there's nothing I don't love about you and your life. I don't care about our differences. Even if I used to use them as lame excuses. I choose you, not my ego or any obstacles, just you and all that comes with. So your divine masculines, some of you guys here, there are some differences between you and them. Could be age, race, you know, religion, whatever it is. And like it says, differences, that's what the Twin Flame journey is about, differences, not the same differences the challenges that you're facing because of differences that you have so they're choosing you and not their ego what else do you want to say please 
I'm going through somewhat of a financial crisis or restructuring right now and might be even changing jobs or careers. As soon as I feel stable, I'll reach out and see how you are. I tell you, they're making plans. They're changing their lives. Taking a break. Relaxing. Because it's like for the first time in their life, they can ex experience happiness and joy. You are my angel. The guiding light in my ascension and the light at the end of this dark tunnel I'm in. I'm like a moth to your flame and plan to run to you as soon as I overcome this. How many of these messages have we seen that saying I'm coming? I'm coming. I'm just making some plan for us. I'm coming. I'm going to reach out. Give me one more, please. I cry myself to sleep and toss and turn over this separation. I miss you so much. It's killing me not to reach out. I love you so much. I also know this isn't the time for us to happen yet. I think that's from the ones here who need to learn their lesson. I've been living a double life and need to make major changes to live a more authentic life. By the time we talk next, I plan to be in a much better situation you can be proud of. Because they know they disappointed you. And it's because they've been living a lie. Living that double life. Because they're trying to please others, doing what others want them to do. Living a life that they know they are not. Just to please others. And at times they're trying to live the life where... I know this is the one I am, the person I am. So I'm going to try to live that life. I'm going to try to be me. But I think they've chosen to be themselves. I feel unsafe, fragile, and vulnerable right now. Totally out of my element. Please pray for my protection while I figure out my way through this illusion into my power. Yeah, I need to get stronger. I need to learn to stand on my own two feet. I need to be that adult that king that emperor that you see me as 1221 despite how anything appears i am faithful to you you have and hold my heart that's your 5d self message to you one two three you always have their heart you always hold their heart they've already chosen you but let me resolve my problems and my issues so you can be proud of me. So you can look at me and say, yes, that's my king. Yes, that's my emperor. Because in doing so, it makes them feel like that emperor. It makes them feel like that king. Just let me do this. This has been your message, guys. To purchase your book or a reading, go to twindyflamed.square.site. Check the description box for all the links. And guys, I now have that special. I still have some spots left, I should say, um, for the, the $20 special on how he or she feels about me. I had to think about it. I still didn't check. But when you go on my website, you will see it. Check under readings or special. All right. And you will see it. It's on sale. 20 Canadian dollars, maybe $15 US. You know, so check that out and i will definitely be implementing my new my new what should i say well my new ways of doing things starting next week i will be doing the coaching sessions and the card reading for you guys um about three times a week and it's gonna be a 40 dollars um, per session we will do it using the zoom so you can pay, I send you the Zoom link and I help you with whatever you're facing, whatever you're going through so that we can align ourselves for union better. And even if that's not your issue, because this whole Twin Flame journey is not just about your Divine Masculine, it's about setting your life up for your prosperity. And if you feel like you are going through a situation that you feel blocked, Come and get a session. I will help you too. Because I'm also a life coach. And that's the reason why I did that course. So I can implement it in the Twin Flame teachings. So I can help you guys better. Alright. 
So starting next week, I'll be doing that for you guys. And I still have that $10 um, live reading messages from your masculine on Tuesday. All right. So take care of yourselves. Love you all. Let go and let God. Thank you for your support. Oh, if you want to know how much $40 Canadian is in your currency, just check Google. I don't know, may maybe it's around $30 US or something, but check. Okay. Anyways, I love you all. Let go and let God. Later.